I'm so excited. My orders finally came in. So if you're ready and into a good sticker haul, then grab a cup of coffee, pull up a chair, and let's dive into all this. Hi, welcome or welcome back to the channel. If this is your first time seeing my hands, hi, I'm Erin of Playing Life with Erin, and I'm so happy you're here with us. Thanks for stopping by. And if you're returning, hey, how have, you, how have you been and how has your week been? All right, guys, so I've been waiting very, very patiently, but I finally received all of my orders. And if you voted, uh, I think I put a poll up last week, um, which shops I ordered from. Um, it was the Washi Tape Shop, Coffee Monster Co., and Jet Pens. And if you chose all of the above, then you were correct because that is what I did. Um, I decided that I've been putting some money away in my envelope for some new stickers and some new things. So I decided to put in another order from the Washi Tape Shop, which I'm really excited to share with you. It's, it's a fairly small order, but um, I did an order with the Washi Tape Shop, and then I ordered from the Coffee Monster Co. Also a fairly small order. And then I have another order from my, my very first order from Jet Pens and a bunch of stickers and things like that. So excited to share that with you guys. Also, it's been a crazy week, but these came in like one at a time. I think Monday, um, my Jet Pens order came in, and then Tuesday, Coffee Monster Co. came in, and then Wednesday, the Wash Tape Shop came in, and now here we are, and I'm ready to share it with all you guys. With you guys, so all right, where should we start? I think I want to start with the Washi Tape Shop, and then work my way to my bigger order, maybe from Jet Pens. So let's move this off to the side for a second and let's just dive right into this because I'm actually quite excited to look at these things. Um, let me see. I want to pull out what I want to swatch this in. Let's get my cousin because I did get a couple of different things, different items. Okay, so I don't have my, I don't have my packing slip. Let me. Let me pull up my order so I can tell you guys exactly what it is that I ordered. And also, um, I will link everything from the washi tape shop down below. And I have a code for you guys too. So if you're interested in anything that I'm showing you today, um, or anything at all on the washi tape shop, um, you can use the code planning Aaron 10 and save 10% off your order. So let's see. What was I doing? Right. I'm trying to remember where my order would be. Go to my email. I've got my iPad in front of me. I came very unprepared to this. It's been a crazy morning already. All right, so let's see. The washi tape shop. All right, let's see. That it? Yes. Okay. Perfect. Okay. So let's start with, we're going to start with this. I got 10 piece savory pastel grid washi tape set. So I was really excited about this because I love grid washi. I really do. And I typically, I use just the white and black grid. Um, but I saw this and I was like, Ooh, I like these colors. So let's get this open. I always feel bad opening this stuff from the wash tape shop because it's wrapped so nicely. Ooh, these are so pretty. Okay. Ooh, all right. So push that off to the side. And then I think, I think I'm going to swatch these in my little bullet journal rather than my Hobonichi. All right, let's see. These are so pretty. Hopefully I can open them because these nails, I should just use my fingernail that doesn't have a nail on it at the moment. <laughs> That makes things a little bit easier. Ooh, that is so pretty. All right, I'm going to pull you guys in a little bit. And we're going to swatch some of these. Let's get a blank page in my book. And these have a backing on them, which I've only used a couple of times with different shops. But I do like, I do like having the backing. 
All right, let's see if I can actually get it off and we will start swatching. Ooh, these are so pretty. So I think, let's see, it is called the Savory Pastel. They're fairly neutral colors, so like pinks and tans. Let me see if I can get this, of course. Okay, I did it, didn't take much effort. I just folded the bottom. Okay. Ooh, I like this wash tape. I like the feel of it. It's nice and like, it's not thick, but it's like a nice medium weight. Ooh, so pretty. All right, so let's do this one. Mary did, let's put this one back. And let's just look at. Ooh, I love these. I like this one a lot. This is like a lighter color with a darker grid. And then I don't know if I want to swatch all of these, but I do like this one. So I went with these because I feel like they still kind of um, reminds me of summer and um, warm weather and are still very neutral. But like this one, I really loved for fall. I think that look really, really pretty with some fall um, fall designs. And also, I did like the neutral for like some vintage spreads and things like that. I really like um, I like doing like junk journaling and things like that. So I've been doing that a lot in my Hobonichi A6 and then using it for journaling, but doing like a vintage junk journaling type theme. So let's see if I can get this. I almost had it and then I got distracted. The cats are like going crazy. The kittens, they're playing with each other. It's like their zoomy time. Oh, I was so camera. close. So this is fairly easy to get off. I just have trouble <laughs> with peeling backs off of things. Um, and also having fake nails does not help. Ooh, that is so pretty. I love that. Okay. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to put these off to the side because I have so many other goodies Simmons. to show you guys. Okay. What else did I get? All right. We're going to keep going with the washi. Aw. They're like, they get so rough with each other. Okay. Um, this one is a moment in time wide washi. This is the pet tape. I'm excited for this one. Oh my goodness, kitties. It's like they just wanna play, play, play. And then one of them, I think it's Poppy. She gets a little too rough with Willow. They're fine though. Okay, ooh. So I went with this because I'm really loving the, the girls that I have. Let me see what I have, or the dolls. I've got these from the wash tape shop. So I decided to get some more, just a different style. So let's get this off and we will swatch these. And these have a little bit of like a shimmer to them or like a, a gloss. That would be a better word. Okay. Ooh, these are so beautiful. Okay, sorry. Oh goodness. Are they all different or do they repeat? How far does this pattern repeat? Okay, so we're still not repeating. Are these? Okay, I think it starts to repeat here maybe. Nope. Are these all different? Okay, wow, that's a lot. So the repeat starts here. Look at all that. Okay, so cute. So let me roll this back up again. Oh goodness. Those kittens, man. That is so cute. All right, so are these, so my question with these are, is it one sheet or are they individual stickers? And I think, I think they actually are one sheet. So let's see. And then you can just cut out what you're going to use. So let's see. Yeah, so this is just one. Let's get my Hoponichi. Let's do my cousin. Let's go to the back. I haven't really been using these pages in the back, so I'm not gonna use the address one, but there's a lot of lines on there, so 
All right, hold on. Change of plans. Let's use my Hobonichi Day Free. We'll just, so I've already swatched it with a bunch of other washi tape shops. So let's go to this page. And then what I'm going to do is I'm going to cut this out. I love this one. I'll get this off. Hmm. Okay, I got it. I got it. I got it. Perfect. Oop, almost didn't get it. Okay. Ooh. Oh, I like that. How it just sits right on the paper. I'm not going to swatch all of them, but I do like that. I like how it does have a little bit of shine or shimmer, gloss, whatever you want to call it, but I don't feel like it would necessarily cause a problem with photo taking if you do it on the right angle. My cats have complete zoomies right now. We have entered the zoomie zone. All right, let's see if I can. You know what? I'm going to try to use... I just need something to get under there. Perfect. There we go. And I'm not going to cut this one, but you can cut this. All right. You know what? Since we got it off, let's. Ah. Technical difficulties today. It's already been a fun morning. Yeah. Okay. Probably just use, um, Ooh, so cute. I'm just gonna place this down. And you could probably use your X-Acto knife to trim around before you peel it off of the washi tape ship uh, roll. So you know what, we're gonna try it that way. Let's do, this is cute. I should put this one on my anniversary day, even though we've already done it. We've already, it says um, Friday. So, my anniversary has already happened, but, oh yeah, okay, that's way better. So just use your X-Acto knife and cut it, and then you can put it down. So cute, and I love how, I just love the, the washi tape feel of some of these stickers and um, how it like, kind of blends right in nicely with the paper. Okay, I'm really liking this one. I'm excited to use it. I really like her, too. She's really pretty. And like all the accessories that you can add. And then it says, do yoga every day. There's like little decorate your home for spring, plant slowly, um, make homemade ice cream by yourself, a se uh, seasonal flowers. Oh, so cute. Okay. And this one says, I can't read that close actually because I can't see what that one says, but there's something written there and there, but I can't see it. Okay. Another washi tape. This one is, let's see. This one is called, quote, memory washi tape. So these have little quotes on them. I was looking for something small and something that will blend into, like I said, like with, into the Toma River paper in my um, A6. So I can use it, uh, use some quotes in there and it just blends right in. Okay, let's see. Or even just my weekly spreads. All right, I'm having trouble today getting off these wrappers most frustrating thing for me when it is when uh, opening things is that I have trouble with wrappers and boxes. My husband and I laugh about it because I'm just like, let me in. I don't look to see if there's like a proper way of opening it, which there probably is. Let's see. All right, let's try not to cut my fingers. Because that's something else that Joe fears for with me. That I will chop my finger off one of these days with scissors, cooking knife, exacto knife. I'm good. I'm good. All right, we got it. We got it, guys. All right, let's find this edge. This is always the fun part of washi. Okay, it's right here. Ah, I can do it. Just goes to show you 
that even with out nails, I still can't do it. So it's not the nails, it's me. Okay. Ooh, these are pretty. You're so lovely. You're so lovely with love, always and forever. I love your smile. Share the love. I love you. Oh, this is so cute. All right, so we're just gonna put this down here. And then that just blends in so seamlessly. All right, let's break that off there. And, oh, these go this way. Oh. Okay, and then it starts again here. So let's do this, let's cut this here because then those go the opposite way. And we'll just kind of put that in there. Ooh, cute. And then let's cut it here. Because then this pattern turns, which is really cute or really great. So like if you want to put something on your side and it goes this way, it says, you make me smile. No, you make me feel special, sorry. Love makes everything better. And then we will cut these. And let's add these in. Swatch these also. So that's quite a few quotes that you get. And you get a happy Valentine's Day. So that's good if you have Valentine's Day. We're a little bit away from that. Ooh, cute. And then they just blend right into the paper so nicely. I like that. Cute, cute. Okay, let's see. What else did I get? This is, let's see. We've got 46 stamp planner stickers. So let's get this open. It's a cute little box it comes in. The wrapper. Ooh, how cute. All right, let's see. How do I, does it just slide? Okay, perfect. That is my kind of box. I really like this. It's so pretty. It's like a matchbox. All right, let's just get out a couple. Let me just test a few. So these are, well, how many are in here? 46 pieces. So let's get my X-Acto knife so we can pull it up. And we'll test a couple. And then we will go through them all. There it goes. Ooh, I like these. All right, so let's put this one down here. Oh, I like that. And then you can write little notes in there or, or let's see, hold on, what do I do with it? You could even put and do something like this. These cats are really distracting me today. But I wonder how this would look. You just took part of your washi and then just stuck that in there. Ooh, I like that. And it looks like a ticket. All right, so then we have one with a B. It's like a postage stamp almost. Let's pull this backing off. Cute. I'll put that one there. These cats are like sumo wrestling. All right, let's see what other ones we have. So we did the B. These are so cute. All right, I'm really excited about these. Oh, I like that one a lot. We have some butterflies, flowers. All oh, these are gonna be great. More flowers. What's this oval one? Cute. Oh, I like the mushrooms. Pretty. Just what I was looking for. Okay, let's see what else do we have in here. Just to add like a little extra, extra layer, some clusters, things like that. Ooh, I like this one. That is really pretty. And got some larger ones. These are cute. Oh, it's a squirrel. <laughs> cute. I think that's a squirrel. Maybe not. It's cute though. We got some larger. And I like how there's like red and some browns, and I think this is maybe a blue. 
It's like a green and then, oh, I guess it's green. And then maybe a navy. That might be navy. So pretty. Oh, I like that one a lot. Let me write on it. So cute. Okay, so there's 46 of those. Really excited to dive into and start creating with some of these. And I really like the little box that it comes in. Okay, and now these are, let's see, what are these? Oh, okay, wait a minute, I was wrong. So these are 60 piece vintage craft stickers. Sorry, so these are the craft stickers. And this is the 46 piece stamp stickers. So these are exactly what they say for stamps. So let's get some out. I might actually add these into that box if there's room. Ooh, these are cute. These will go really nicely with the, um, these labels. These, so cute. All right, let's see, let's get this one off. Backing. Oh, I like that. It does have a little bit of a gloss to it. And add a little bit more dimension, have some more textures on your, journaling or um your spreads oh these are so cute all right let's do another one um let's do this cute little squirrel so these are going to match somewhat with some of the ones that I was just looking at those were the vintage craft stickers okay I'll pop this in here Ooh, I like that. All right, so I'm not sure. Oh, I might have to go break up the cats. Get a little rough in here. I think these will go back in here, and if they don't, I might just add them to the box later. Okay, so we're gonna push this off to the side, and excuse me for a minute while I go separate the cats. Okay, broke up the cats for now. Let's see how long that lasts for. And let's clean some of this up so we can make some room four. We'll do jet pens next. Or maybe I'll save jet pens for last. Let's do a coffee monster next. All right, so let's move this off to the side. Okay, take a sip of coffee. And the cats are going at it again. My goodness. Okay, they're just full of energy today. All right, so this was my package from the Coffee Monster Co., which I have been pretty excited about. Um, I actually have a bunch of things coming in. Um, I think I have two sub boxes coming in maybe. One's definitely on its way to me because I got the notification for it. And then I did a pre-order um, and I'm not sure when those will be coming in. I'm really excited. Um, should be soon or soon-ish. We'll, we'll go with soon-ish. So it's pretty cool because I have I got this order and this was... What was this order? This was just new releases, I think. I'm trying to remember now. Um, let's see. Let's see if I can pull it up. Okay, yeah, I think these were some new releases and I don't remember what else it was. I can't remember if it was a sale or something. Goodness, it was a while ago. So like I said, all this stuff just started coming in. Okay, I got this. This is a Misfit Little Bits um, frosted pouch. So I got this to hold things like, um, so I don't really have a three ring binder that I'd be using it in. I do have a pouch that I store my um, Hobonichi cousin in, or if I'm just gonna be on the go, I was thinking I could use this to hold some of my um, sticker sheets. So like if I just wanted to go, um, I don't know, out for the day and or to a coffee shop and I wanted to take some of these sheets with me, I could just very easily put them in here and they would be ready to go and just kind of put them in my planner bag. So I thought that was really nice. Um, I love these kind of pouches. And it's so cute. I don't know if you guys can see that. So adorable. Little bits. I like it. Okay. I got that, and then what else did I get? I don't remember. Oh yeah, I got the four, um, the four pocket. No, I'm sorry, eight quarter pocket. I think I got one. So let's see how many are in here. I got like one bundle. Oh wow, 
so many. Okay, so these are gonna be really good for what I'm thinking is for my, um, the samplers, like the, the monthly um, freebie that you get. So let's see. And they'd also be good for like bean samplers and things like that, but let's see. And these will go great in my sticker organization. Oh, look at that, it's in there, perfect. And you can just pop these in in the back. And there you go, good to go. Oh, I like that, cute. Okay, well right now I've been taking them all and just kind of clipping them with my cute little clip here. But I think these are gonna work out really great. And also, um, I think they would be good for if you wanted to have, um, oh, it's a little glary. You could probably put pictures in here too if you just wanted to use this like in part of like if you had a three ring binder planner system, or not three ring, a six ring, um, you could like use this as like your photo page. So that's cute too. Okay, move this off to the side. <clears throat> and then I got, Let's see, what else did we get? We got the seven divider set. So this is for a sticker binder. And I have, we don't have the Coffee Monster Co. sticker binder. Um, it's super cute. And I did not want to stress myself out trying to get one. So <clears throat> I thought they would look really cute. Oh my gosh, I love this material. Okay, I thought they would look really, really cute in my sticker binder that I already have. And it'd be really nice to have like, so right now the way I use this binder, <clears throat> I use, excuse me, I use one of the five by seven full sleeves to um, be the front cover, if you will, for the binder, but oh my goodness, that is gonna be so cute. Ah, I love it. Okay, and then on here, I'm not sure, um, but you can write, I don't know if I'm gonna write my, there's so many of them and I, I do like these, but maybe what I can do is I'll be able to put these on here like that maybe and I can make them look a little bit better, a little neater. So then this way I can move them around if I need to. Oh, that is so cute. So this came with seven, there's this pattern. This one is like, this is my favorite um, design. I have to say, I have the washi tape, I have some vellum and I absolutely love it. This one's so pretty, I love these colors. Okay, and of course, just classic emoji, how cute. And this is so pretty with the rainbow colors. And it is just one-sided, so the back side is going to be white. And some pencils, I love these. Okay, and so like, I might use something like the pencils for like my adulting one, my adulting emoji section, which is just basically all the things, like, you know, doctor's appointments, shopping, um, cleaning, haircuts, bills, things like that. So I think that might look cute in that section. Oh, I am obsessed. Oh, and then we have the polka dotted one. So cute. I'm very excited to use these and get this all put together. So cute. Really excited. And I love how it fits perfectly in here. Like I said, I really do want to get my hands on one of her binders, but the last couple of times we've been available, I haven't been able to like sit and kind of focus to like get it. So next time. Okay, so now on to the stickers. What stickers did I get? Don't even remember. Okay. Let's see. Ooh, cute. So this is the July freebie. And let's see, today is the 29th. So these will be put an order in between now and Sunday, you would get this one. Oh, kitties are in something. Excuse me. Don't need that. Okay. Trying to eat my packaging over here. Poppy, come on, girl. They hear crinkle, crinkle, and they go crazy, crazy. Okay, so that is super cute. And then I did get, all right, so I got a, like, TV show tracker because we've been watching a couple of good TV shows, and I wanted to, um be able to write down what it was and what I thought of it. Like right now we're watching Fatal Attraction on Paramount maybe, and I'm really, really liking that show. Um, and then what else were we watching? We were watching, um, I just ran off with some more packaging, so I had to go get that from her. 
so what was I saying? All right, so we're watching, um, we're watching Fatal Attraction on Paramount, and then what are we watching? We just watched something on Netflix. OMG. See, this is why I want this, so I can write it down. A lot of times, too, like, what, what we were watching on Netflix, it's going away. Like, it just, it, the season ended, and then they're going to restart it again. I can't remember what it was. It'll come to me. Um, but, yeah, so we've been watching a few different shows, and I want to be able to write it down, and then maybe even write in, like, you know, if this was, like, season, half of season one or something like that. So, I love those. So cute. And then I got more of my book writing emojis. I like to add these in to my planner also so I know when I finish the book and what I thought of it. I did get more of the daily affirmation stickers. I was running low on those. And then of course my budgeting emojis. I needed more of those. I use these twice a week. Okay and then I have, let's see, oh I did get some reading ones. Let's see. Ah, okay. Um, a new book, so this way I can write down when I started a book and when I finished. So cute. I love those. And then, oh, my reading bucket list because I want to have a little bit more like in my reading journal, I think. So I might add a page with some of these so that I know what I'd like to read. And then I got some of these. These are for the weeks, the whole two weeks. These are day covers, just very plain and simple, black and white, and I'm really liking these. These are the dates for the Hobonichi cousin, or the days, rather. So cute. And then these, oh, I love so much. So these are date covers for the Hobonichi cousin. So I'll probably use these um, in this upcoming week of spread so we can test all these out and see how absolutely adorable they are. Okay. And let's see, what was my bean card? Zucchini bread. All right, so here's the thing. I have, I think I have like two or three extras of these. I have to double check and confirm, but I know for sure I have this one and then I have at least one other one. So if you are seeking out a zucchini bread, please reach out and we will work something out and I will send it to you. Okay. All right, now moving on to... <clears throat> get this out of the way and move this over. Okay, so I'm really excited about this order. This is from Jet Pens. Let's take a sip of coffee. I put my post-it over that so you guys can't see my address. But I did open this um, and I really, I haven't looked at anything. I just kind of peeked in. And I do have a packing slip so we can. <clears throat> tell you guys everything that I got. So now this is my first time ordering from Jet Pens. I was pretty excited. I got a lot of stuff, I think. Anyways, what's this? Ooh, cute. Okay. All right. I got a lot of stick. Oh my goodness. These cats, I can't. <laughs> They're like in sync. They just jumped up onto the table. Both of them knocked off the tissue box. I can't. Okay. So I got a bunch of stickers. <clears throat> Excuse me. I don't know what's up with my throat today. Um, and I probably cannot say any of them. So we're going to just kind of go over them and I'll tell you what they are. Okay, so I got a dot liner. I did need a new um, double-sided tape. So let's see how this is. Let's get this out of the package. Ooh. Okay. Well, that's neat. I like how that opens and closes like that. That's neat. Okay. It's called the dot liner flick. It's in here. Oh, I know what that is. Okay, I'm going to wait for that. All right, so I did get these little index clips. I've been kind of seeing them everywhere, and I like them. Um, I like the idea of them to be able to just kind of mark my page in some of my journals so I know where I am um, and I don't have to like put a permanent tab on. So, ooh, these are nice. How many are on here? One, two, three, four, five, eight. Well, it says right there, fine. Ooh, I like these a lot, let me see. Let's, so like for instance, I have my 
Tobonichi. This is my day free. I use this for planning, uh, for budgeting. So, I don't want to open up to a page where my budget going on right now. So, take this, and I would just kind of clip it on here. And then I would be able to have that page marked. Probably, I probably do it on the top actually. Let's do it this way. Because in this way, so I do have the month, I have it marked out by the month. I have all the tabs on the side, but I don't have like the weeks. So this would be nice to slip on, if I can see. And then just have it at the top so I can see okay and then just flip open to that particular week for my bills and my budgeting so that is really cute these are gonna be very handy I'm super excited about these all right I'll put that off to the side and that's trash okay and now I've got all of these stickers I'm really excited about these stickers so these are just like little mini icon stickers um and I went a little crazy because why not they're stickers um but let's see Let's put them, these are the same brand, and I can't say it, which is terrible, I know. All right, let's see, so I've got three different types, okay. All right, these are super cute. These have a little bit of a puff to them, which is okay, I don't mind that. As long as it's not like super, super puffy, I don't mind. Oh, and these are on clear back. Nice. These are cute. So these are the plant. These are all about plant, ah, plant and gardening. Which I really, I don't like to garden. If you've been on the channel for a minute, I do not like to garden. But I like the little plant icons. And I do have some indoor plants that I want to remember to water. They don't need to be watered that often. But I like to mark down when I've watered them so that I don't forget. And when Joe is accusing me of killing the indoor plants, I'm like, no, no, I haven't. So, <laughs> these are cute. These are, let me see, does it say on here? Can we not... I got Willow in the box over here. The little teeny tiny box just trying to get in it. Um, all right, let's see. These are, I don't remember what these are. These are like favorite things maybe? Well, come on. These are, let's see. I think these are the favorite ones. So we've got some sunglasses and glasses and clothes. I've got a bathing suit, so I thought these would be really cute. My goal is I would like to memory plan in my ASICs, like in the calendar part, um, and then just put in like little, little stickers on things that we did. So like, for instance, let's say, let's get to the month. Like, so for July. So on the 8th, we had a party at my um, cousin's house and then we went swimming yesterday at her house so like we could use the sunglasses just to mark it and then maybe write it in so I thought that'd be really cute Poppy is coming up on the desk but we're gonna move her because there's so much stuff here okay so these are really cute I like these and like nail polishes so, like when I get my nails done all right what else let's see okay these are home sweet home oh my goodness these cats my little tiny washi tape shop box they're both trying to get into. Okay, so these are Home Sweet Home. I'm trying to, I think that's good, like that. Get it away from the light. Let's see, if I take it out, it would be better because it is on a clear backing also, I think. So I don't know how shiny that will be. Yeah, so it's just as shiny. Um, but this has... Hold on, these cats. Goodness. Oh, goodness, Papa, come on. Right here, go by the box. Good. <laughs> she's like rolling around on my feet and just trying to get the packing stuff out and the tissue paper out. Okay, 
So these have like things for the house. I really like the boho vibes of this. Like I have a couple of these hanging from my wall in my bedroom actually. And I'm just really enjoying that. And then I think that's supposed to be a dog, but we have cats in this house, but that's all right. We can still pretend. So that's cute. I like those. This one is daily. So this one has just mostly planning stuff on here. So like whether you're working or, um, got the calendar, note plan, planning, some warrant here, good luck. Oh, I really like that. Eat, play, eat, play, love. That's cute. Oh, I like this. So on days that maybe I'm planning, I can use these. And then there's a couple coffee beans. So I'm really liking these a lot. This one is called Cafe. And this one actually kind of reminds me of the antique shops that we used to go to in New Hampshire all the time. It's been a while since I've been up there, but just, it kind of gives me vibes of the antique shops and then one of the restaurants, The Common Man. We used to love that. I love that restaurant. Um, so it just gives me those kind of vibes. Um, but I'm really liking this vintage signs and the old telephone, some shelves. So cute. I'm really excited to use these. Okay. And then this one is daily something. So this has got, oh wow, this one's super cute. This one's got some food, some strawberries, some um, macarons. What else? Coffee, of course. And then a couple of little a daily something, diamonds, some oh, churros. Mm, we have some churros. Um, what else? That looks like a jelly donut, but I'm not sure. Can you guys hear that? That is her trying to get in that little box. Both of you, come on. So I have a crock pot that my mom and my dad got Joe and I for our anniversary. It's a big box. So I haven't taken the crock pot out of the box yet, but I definitely need to because these kittens are like trying to get in a box this big. Okay. So anyways, back to the sticker haul. Get some shoes, sunglasses, and I like the little pops of color. Like this is, let me see, I'm trying to get in there so you guys can see it. This is like a pretty turquoise color. And then this mustardy gold color. I absolutely adore these two colors together. So super duper cute. I'm really excited to use those. And then these are Midori stickers. So I just did some weather icons. So we have like hot or sunny rather. And then you have partly cloudy and raining, snowing, cloudy, all the things. So I'm really excited to use these. These are also, so these next five will be Midori. These are, I don't know what these are called. These are all removable also. So these are just gray stickers. So there's like a variety of different things on here. This is a chair. Oh, there's a cat right there. Um, we've got a wolf and some glasses, nail polish, some clothes. And then these are some like little icons like happy and sad, traveling, birthday, things like that. So these are more functional down here so cute these are the let's see these are the beige so these are a little different these got some socks it's a kangaroo on there but then again at the bottom here you have all of your um let me see i'll take these out let's see if i can get these out oh so these you have more of your functional stickers okay you can't see it that way um down here so you have some coffees and some shopping and cars and things like that so you can add these into your calendar and they're small so they work in your weeks or they'd work in your a6 or any small bullet journal planner that you've got going on okay these are also from Adori. oh this little kitten hmm. Okay, so these are the lavender ones. Again, you have like some decorative pieces up top. We have ice cream and let's see, that looks like a little ghost. You could use that for like Halloween. Bird, some nail polish, so self-care time. Oh, that's the cutest little squirrel. Okay, um, some forest creatures and things like that. And then again, you have the bottom part that has like your more um, functional icons and things like that. This one is Moss green right we did the beige yes this is moss green and i just really was loving these colors and i'm kind of thinking towards like september october i really don't want to be thinking about fall especially today when it's going to be like 100 degrees here today i do love summer i'm not complaining about summer i'm not rushing summer but i do love the colors of fall so kind of thinking a little bit more ahead of the game with some of my coloring 
my color palette. So I did the moss green. I'm really liking this truck right here and this cute little porcupine. Sorry guys, I'm keeping it to the side because I don't want the glare. These kittens are driving me mad. Okay, these are super cute. And then again, at the bottom you have your functional icons in that moss green, so cute. And then this one is, so, cause I'm gonna be working out. I know I'm going to be working out. These are, which ones are these? Am I missing some? Hmm. I feel like maybe I'm missing some. What is this one? This one's a workout one. Oh, I see it now. Okay, so this is achievement. These are exercise animals. So they're just little cute emojis or icons for working out because I'm going to. And then there, there's some healthy foods. You got some bananas and apples and a little avocado. I'm really hoping you guys can see this. So this is super cute. I'm really excited to use these. I'm gonna use these for my workout days. And then this, I have, so I've not used these type of stickers before. So I guess this is a transfer sticker sheet. And this one is by Moo, M-U, Moo, I guess. So these are really cool. These are called, what was the sticker sheet called? Flower Moon. Really liked these. Let me see if I can pull this out and see if we can get it without a glare. So I guess the way that you use these, again, I've never used them before. I've seen other people use them. So you just kind of cut it out. It's probably like, um, it seems like it's very much like a, like a temporary tattoo. So you take it off and then you kind of like use this to rub it down on the paper. These cats are so destructive today between their zoomies and all the paper. They're going crazy. Ooh, so pretty. So I don't know if you guys can see that a little bit better. These are absolutely gorgeous. And then you cut and I think you probably remove this backing but I have to look at it. I have to see there's like a step-by-step -step direction. Hi, Poppy. There's Poppy, guys. I really love these. I especially liked, excuse me. I liked this one right here. I thought that was really pretty with the moon. So I'm really excited to use these. And these should go right onto the paper um, and like be one with the tone of the paper, just like some of these washi tapes that I have. Excuse me, were you just drinking my coffee? I think she was just drinking my coffee. <laughs> okay. And oh, we'll put this off to the side. I'm not going to try to put this back in, but that's what this tool is for. It is to smooth um, or rub, I should say, these on. So it's going to be really neat. Okay. And then, of course, because why not? I had to get a sticker book for the new stickers because I like to be organized. So let's get this open. dive into this. I'm kind of excited about this. Okay. So, what is this? What are these? Ooh. Are these like removable? Oh, yeah. Okay. I think these are removable sticker sheets. Maybe? I'm not sure. That's what it seems like, though. And then these are just pouches, so you can. Oh my goodness, with these cats today. Okay. So I will probably like take them out of the packaging, but you can just slide them in. Ooh, I like this. And then add them in. So it's one pocket, right? Yep, it's one pocket, but you can just slide your stickers in, your sticker sheets back to back just like that oh I like that that's gonna be nice so I will categorize this and load all this up oh I'm so excited okay like this a lot and then let's see how does this work this is clipped on here oh okay I see Let's unhook this, if I can get this other one in there. 
Yeah, okay. And then this is going to come off. Okay. Note to self when a filming and unboxing. <laughs> I put the kittens in the other room, even though I don't like to do that very often, but there is just far too much crinkly stuff around here for them. Okay, so that's cute. I like that. And again, I feel like, ooh, I feel like this is small enough where I could take this on the go with me. So like if I wanted to plan in my A6, as I drop things, I could take this and this with me and it's pretty compact. Um, and if I needed to bring other supplies with me, like I showed you earlier in the video, if I can find it from the Coffee Monster Co. You can put some things in here. And then just pop this into your planner bag. Easy peasy. All right, I'm liking this a lot. Okay, so I'm really excited to show you guys these things. Let me know what your thoughts are. If you've tried some of these products before, if they're new to you. Have you ever shopped at Jet Pens before? Is Jet Pens also new to you? Um, I have not bought any pens from Jet Pens, but I do have another order. Um, I think I might try some retractable, um, or not retractable, um, mechanical pencils from, um, I think it was Jet Pens that I was looking at them. Um, so I'm really excited about that. The order came in fairly fast and I thought it was very reasonable. So I was pretty excited and, um, I have a bunch of new goodies to try. So what's better than that? Okay, guys. Um, do I have anything else to share with you guys? I don't think I do. So this was kind of like a video where I feel like I was all over the place. A lot of things to show you um, and very rambunctious kittens. So if you have stuck around for this long, thank you very much. I am very happy you are still here with us. And if you are interested in other things coming from the channel, don't forget to hit that subscribe that subscribe button and hit the notification, um, the bell notification. So you will always be notified anytime something new comes out on the channel because we're always trying to bring you some new things here at Planning Life with Erin. And as always, thank you so much for taking time out of your day to come and spend it with me because I know we are all so busy. So I am very, very thankful. Um, thank you. And um, until I see you again, have a beautiful week and keep planning. Bye.